Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. That's what we're gonna have to have right there. Right, it's nice. Right it's there, nice. It's gonna be nice. Very yeah. nice. We're gonna try to lower it now and see if it hits the fender. <laughs> you guys are gonna have a nice little laugh. It just destroys my fender. Here we go. What's up, GBG? So today, what we're gonna do is, as you guys know, um, I got new wheels, um, and they're a lot wider than my stock wheels that I had on it. So, it's time for some fender rolling. Um, I'm not gonna really do like a step-by-step, -step, uh, but I'll show you guys what I do with a, what I like, I fender roll, because there's a lot of fender rolling videos out there. So, anyway, Right off the bat, I would like to give like a really huge shout out to Austin Cannon. Um, he made us stickers for Gas Butter Garage, so he made the first batch of stickers ever for Gas Butter Garage. So I'll put him down in the description below. So if you ever need stickers or anything, definitely hit him up because we have this one as a banner he made, and then also he made us uh, some smaller stickers that have the YouTube logo and then Gas Butter Garage. So. If you ever need any stickers, definitely hit him up. Um, he has great prices and they're really quality stickers, so awesome. We'll get to it. So we've done basically we've done all the fenders except one and we have one more left It's been like it's probably taken us about three and a half hours I guess I have to say and that's with like filming everything and uh, We we knocked it out actually this is the first time like I said doing it and everything So I actually got pretty good fitment. We'll show you guys after we have all of them done, but uh Andrew's uh, right here heating it up and everything still so uh we're gonna get that done and we have one more and we'll throw it on the ground. We got tennis in here too. He's actually gonna be cutting his fenders. We had, actually didn't get on video either, but <laughs> he tied his uh, Jeep to a tree and uh, pulled a dent out because like, he backed in a light pole, but you know, that's what Hagger Garage did with their Miata. But anyway, we'll get right back to you once we have everything done, so awesome. All right, dude, like what, what, like I was rolling my fenders, but dude, what are you doing to your Jeep? It looks like you just like slaughtered your Jeep right here. You I feel got like I'm gonna get like back tetanus bumper. Just staring at it. I know, dude. You got the exhaust cut off. So what are you doing, Tyson? Uh, <laughs> just cutting out my exhaust to make it louder. Taking off my back bumper because I'm gonna spray that black. All right. I'm gonna cut my fenders. So basically, and, yeah. like 
he's gonna cut his fenders, but we're not doing it tonight because it's gonna get too dark. But like, as we said before, he pulled out his back bumper with the tree. We got the hookup right here. We got this bad boy tree from Home Depot. We planted it today. And uh, we're gonna pull out this dent because I think he hit another tree while he's budding, but we're gonna see if it works for the front. So here we go. All right, you're good. Stronger than the back bumper. Yeah. Oh, scrap. All right. Oh yeah. That's probably doing like more actually. Yeah, that's what I said. You just have to bend the bottom of it. For those of you that uh, have Jeep Jam Cherokees, wow, I can't even say the name. Good try. Cherokees, yeah. Jeep Cherokees. Yeah, yeah. Tennyson's the guy if you need to know anything right here. Clearly, jumping on mud. <laughs> he loves mudding, so if you guys like mudding, he's the guy to hit up because he knows all the spots. So we're finally finished. We got like, it, was, it probably took us four hours to do the whole thing. And we're like really tired. It's so hot outside. That's actually like cooled down a little bit, but it, it was hot the whole day. We're pretty sweaty, but we're gonna go to ahead and uh, get some uh, food and everything. But um, I will show you right here. Um, basically like this back left one is the only one that gave us like trouble with anything really. Uh, like it's pretty tight, I have to say. Like that footman is pretty good. I can fit my fingers just barely. So, and in, in reality, I think I'm gonna have to like raise a little bit more. But I'm gonna see how much that ride is good or how it rides right now. But the front is so perfect. Like uh, we got the front pretty much on point, like right away, which I'm pretty happy with. Like it's so perfectly, e even turning, it's perfect. So all together, like. I really like hope you guys like enjoy the full video and everything. It wasn't like how to roll fenders and everything. It was just to see my car with the new wheels on and everything. So I hope you guys enjoy. And just always remember, like, comment, subscribe, GPG if you guys like the video. And always have a wonderful day. Peace out, guys.